Here's your Storm Track 7 forecast. Good Wednesday morning. I'm Storm Track 7 meteorologist Kyle Keel. Threat tracker in the green here the next few days. We do have some showers around here early this morning. It does dry out this afternoon, but it will become pretty windy as we will see wind gusts upwards of 25 to 35 miles per hour. A few more showers are possible here as we head into tomorrow, mainly east of Waterloo. And then Friday, we have a partly cloudy sky. So threat tracker in the green. If it were in the yellow, orange, or red, or even the purple, that would indicate some severe weather, but luckily no severe weather expected today, but it is severe weather awareness week. So just wanted to remind you that the sirens are going to sound in most communities at 11 o'clock this morning as Iowa has its annual statewide tornado drill. Again, most communities will sound the sirens, but in the Cedar Rapids Metro, the Lynn County Emergency Management Agency has opted not to sound the sirens. So you won't hear them there. Uh, you will hear your NOAA weather radios go off, though, if you have those up and going, which you should, uh, because that uh, tornado drill will be activated along with the weekly test. So at 11 o'clock, we will start to hear that tornado drill go over the weather radios. And this is also just a good time to practice the emergency plan. Hopefully your workplace, your child's school is doing stuff, and hopefully you have a plan at home in case severe weather strikes, because as we know here in Iowa, it can happen any time of day and any day of the year. Again, no severe weather today, but it will be a little windy at times. Again, early this afternoon, we could see wind gusts anywhere from 25 to 35 miles per hour. And then tonight, as that low pressure tracks away, that wind will really die down. So as we head towards tomorrow morning, uh, that light wind is going to allow those temperatures to cool off a little more than what we've been seeing here the last several days. As for the rain, we're going to keep the rain in the forecast here through the early morning hours. A threat tracker, or I should say future track, shows that rain tracking off to the northeast here this afternoon and we'll be left with dry conditions. Dry conditions will continue through the morning hours tomorrow, but as we head toward the afternoon hours, we are going to start to see the potential for a few scattered showers. Yes, we could see some showers mainly east of Waterloo tomorrow. All of us do get that chance for some scattered showers here today. Our forecast has those west winds 15 to 25 miles per hour with temperatures in the upper 40s to lower 50s. So not much movement with those temperatures. Partly to mostly cloudy tonight, dry with temperatures in the 30s. That'll lead us to temperatures back near 50 degrees here tomorrow. Some locations staying in the upper 40s. We do have that best chance for rain east of Waterloo. By the time we head into Friday, all of us are going to stay dry with temperatures in the lower to middle 50s. And your 10-day forecast shows warmer temperatures for the weekend. However, we do have a chance for rain here on Saturday. Looks to be pretty scattered, but not the best day on Saturday. Sunday looks pretty good with plenty of sunshine. Early next week, we're going to notice that wind really pick up, and then there is a slight chance for rain on Tuesday. Otherwise, most of next week is looking dry.